All right, greetings everybody, Del Puckett here. In this video, I'm gonna do two things. The first thing here is we're gonna go in for an upgrade on this genuine Cuban 3 string cigar box guitar. Um, this one originally has the graphic equalizer and a piezo. And what I'm gonna do here in this upgrade here, we're gonna install pickup right here in the neck position and then a three-way switch so that's the first thing and then the second thing is, is I just kind of wanted to show you a couple different ways on how to set up your graphic equalizer all right so the first order of business is take the strings off and then take off the screws that hold the hinge in place and don't forget to <clears throat> keep track of all the little screws and then you're going to take off the, the, the little screws from the corners. Don't lose that. Take it apart. Take the neck out. By these screws on the back. And then what I did is I measured <clears throat> exactly where I wanted this pickup to go. Actually, I measured while well, the strings were on to get it centered. right, And then just carved it out with the... Um, Dremel and files. And then I hit the edges with Sharpie black magic marker so that you really can't see it. So that when the pickup is mounted, it'll look like that. Of course, it'll be black. And I also gouged out the neck right there so that the pickup mount and I also painted the uh, or used the sharpie on these edges right here so that when you're looking in around the edges you don't see any of the wood you just see black all right it actually took a little while but I finally got it I got the pickup installed the switch installed and the switch switches between the under the saddle piezo which goes through the graphic equalizer preamp then the other side of the switch is the single coil originally I had it so that both the single coil and the piezo were both going through the equalizer but I got too much static when I was on the single coil so I took it all apart and then I wired them separately so that the single coil is on one side of the switch and then the piezo through the equalizer is on the other side of the switch. So, this is the way it sounds. All right, so we're gonna plug into the Roland Microcube and all the settings are straight up in the middle. There is no effects. We'll start off on the piezo with the, uh, the graphic flat. So that's a standard piezo sound. This will be in the middle will be piezo and single coil single coil.
want to talk about setting up this graphic equalizer. So you want to make sure that the battery is good. If not, you can just replace the battery. It's in there. I usually go with the volume up all the way. You don't have to, but I do. And the way I normally start out is I put these guys right in the middle, smack dab in the middle. And then I'm just going to use my ear and I'm only going to play with one knob at a time. I'm going to start off with the bass. And again, I just use my ear and I dial it into the to where I like it, right? Uh, obviously, if you're having feedback issues or annoying uh, frequencies, you could uh, dial those, figure it out and dial those out if you don't like it. But as far as just sound quality, I just use my ear to get a pleasing sound. Now I'm going to try the uh, mid-range. So it's very responsive. And actually all those sounds are really good. So you could just put it to wherever you want here. Uh, the tre treble, let's try the treble. I like that one right in the middle. And then uh, the presence, which is like the treble of trebles. So not a whole lot of response there. So it seems to be the most responses in the mid-range. So I got like a little smiley face here. So there's no right way or wrong way. Uh, there's just how it, how it sounds to your ear. Another way to do it is take them all, all the way flat, all the way off, right? And then just introduce whatever you like. The other way is to crank them all straight up, right? 100% on every one of them. And then they can do what they call subtractive EQ, where you just take out the ones that's annoying. However it is that you arrive at where you, you like your setting, go with that. And keep in mind that you might have it set up perfectly, and then you change like the room you're in, and then all of a sudden all those settings are whack. So you'll probably have to set it up every time you plug in and tune up. All right, last but not least, listen to this. So there's a bunch of little wires and, and pieces of junk and, and like these little pieces of the wire that are inside here. The way to get them out, I just turn it upside down and shake. Right, there it is. Eventually it comes out. Yay. And also this pickup was made black by using a Sharpie. 